I want to show you our North Dallas uh, camera and roadways a little bit wet in parts of North Texas because of some scattered showers moving around. So want to point out as we go through the day today, here's the first alert future cast uh, 630 to 7 o'clock. The scattered showers around this morning, but I want you to look at or it says Abilene. That's the clearing line and going through about 7, 8, 9 o'clock. That clearing line moving its way from west to east into the afternoon hours. We see that cloud cover clearing out a lot of sunshine to round out the afternoon hours on election day and then the sun setting for us and by the time we get to seven o'clock clear skies on the way but this morning it's not a bad idea to have the umbrella with you taking a look at the first alert radar you can see that we do have the shower activity continuing across parts of the metroplex especially through parts of dallas county into collin county some light rain is greeting you making the roadways a little bit slick this morning so have the umbrella with you as you step on out heading to the poles uh, the more widespread rain and heavy rain is in the east sides of north texas but i want to show you to the west. See how the scattered shower activity is even less in cover. So tapering off and that clearing line is already now making its way through parts of Abilene. So that's a sign of what we will see through the hours ahead on this election day. Gray skies in parts of Denton County thinning out a little bit. DFW reporting light rain right now with a westerly wind at 12 and 62 degrees. It's a DFW 12 degrees colder than this time yesterday morning being reported. So 10 to 15 to almost 20 degrees colder. Have the light jacket with you as you step on out of the door this morning. It's 56 Bridgeport to cater to the low 60s across the Metroplex mid 50s to the west low 60s to the east. We will see all of us today in the 60s. So here is your hour by hour election day forecast. If you can go ahead and look at the screen right now because we will see some spotty showers over the next few hours at a 30 to 20 percent chance. If you want to go ahead and just take a picture of this so you have the uh, forecast for you through the day ahead by 11 to near noon 63 degrees on our way up to about 65 to 67 degrees. Don't forget, you also have the hour by hour forecast on our CBS News app. Uh, you'll be able to see a lot of sunshine by three to four and then give way to some more clearing skies by six o'clock to seven o'clock this evening. Clear skies on the way and we'll see temperatures cool enough. You might need the light jacket going into Friday. We have a first alert weather day for strong to severe storms in the forecast, alerting you to that fact, rounding out your week an area of low pressure approaching cold front sliding its way to the east northeast and by Friday morning storms out west increasing in coverage into the afternoon to then the late evening hours, possibly dealing with some gusty winds, maybe some larger hell with them. We'll continue to monitor this forecast through the week ahead. Your first alert 70 forecast shows rain coverage at 70% Friday, but then Clearing out for the weekend, highs in the 60s to the 70s, Veterans Day 76 degrees. 648, we'll be right back.